Good morning, everyone. Today, we're just gonna get right on into it and I'm going to be testing out these eyelid tapes. So, if you haven't noticed, I have incredibly, incredibly hooded eyes, which basically means I have no eyelid space when I look directly forward. So, the issue I run into is fake eyelashes look really bad on me because they just like take up my entire lid. It looks like really weird if I wear top eyeliner. It looks like I'm just wearing black eye, like black eyeshadow. Um, yeah, I can't do a whole lot. Like I can't do the cut crease um, eyeshadow and all that. And it just, I run into a lot of issues with my hooded eyes and there's nothing wrong with hooded eyes, but sometimes I just wish I could explore more makeup techniques you know what i mean these come with 600 little tapey things and then this tool to like press it into your eye um it says these eyelid tape the eyelid tape is not limited to the eye shape whatever that means instructions make sure the eye your eye area is clean and makeup free fold the paper support back and gently remove eyelid tape from the edges you can trim the eyelid tape to the desired shape if necessary so you're supposed to be able to put these on on clean skin and then do whatever makeup you want over top of it. So today I'm just going to be testing out fake eyelashes with these and see how it goes. My face is completely bare. As you can tell, I don't even have moisturizer or anything on right now. So let's, let's test this out. It's in a little heart shaped thingy and there's like a whole roll of stickers. I guess I'll just like put this strip right where my crease is. I don't know. Okay. It's a pretty good first try. I'm gonna use this thing to like really push it back. Ew, this is kinda gross. I'm poking my eyeball out. Not too bad. They're definitely less hooded. It's pretty see-through. Hopefully with um my makeup on, you won't be able to see it all. Let's try the other side. I feel like this side's not gonna be as easy. Oh no. I, like bent it. Oh no. Ow. Okay, well those really stick. Ow! Oh. Okay. That one is actually better than the other one. I'm gonna try to redo this one because this one's a lot better. All right, let's try this again. Uh. Huh? Maybe. This is it right now. It's the best as I'm gonna get today. I'm gonna go put on like my regular makeup over these, see if they stay, see if they're more or less transparent and then we're gonna put on fake eyelashes and see how they look and then I'll take one off to show you what one side looks like compared to the other. Makes sense? Be right back. All right, so I am back. I just put on my normal everyday makeup and yeah. That one, I think it's because it's not correctly on like I didn't put it exactly on my crease but pretty early on it started to pop up you can't tell when my eyes are like open but when I look anywhere other than straight you can definitely tell this one is still pretty good um I don't know I feel like no one would notice unless I told them but I don't know I wish they didn't peel up at all 
um, so that's kind of annoying. But when again, when I look straight ahead, it looks pretty good. Um, they're not really uncomfortable unless I look completely up. I can only really feel them then. These are from Primark. They are super long, and normally I could never wear these because they would take up my entire face. So we're going to try these. I'm going to put them on both, and then I'm going to take off this one just to show you what they would normally look like. And then... I might try to put on one more over my makeup and see if they stick. All right, let's just pop these on. Probably not dried enough, but do it anyway. Like, just look at how bad this one looks. It's, I don't, uh, no. I would definitely have to get better at this if I were to actually wear these in person. <laughs> because, like, I think this one looks pretty good. Um, but this one is just laughable. Like, there's no way anyone would ever believe that you know I don't know I just feel like I look like a lunatic I just feel like they look so weird all right so I'll show you what it typically looks like see that there's absolutely no lid space and I look even more scary this helps a little bit for sure um, I don't know. What do you guys think? Do you think this looks better? Do you think I should just wear them even though they look like this? Or do you think I should just all together never wear fake lashes? Because that's kind of where I'm at right now. All right, and then I'll put on one more over top of this to see if I can get it even less. Like maybe I can double up. Definitely made it less hooded, but that looks insane. And the more you pile them on, the more, and that did not stick at all. So I'm probably gonna be experimenting with these a little bit more, maybe with like um, eyeshadow on top, it would look a lot more normal. Um, but as far as helping me out with fake lashes, I don't know that it did all that much. Maybe if I could just get, like, a less dramatic pair, then it would look better. Um, and I also will be trying it with top eyeliner because I've never been able to wear top eyeliner. So, not a complete fail. Um, I think with practice, I can definitely get them to look much, much better. Um, and just see what works and what doesn't. So, let me know what you think in the comments. If you like them, if you hate them, if you think I look terrifying. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you are subscribed because I post every Tuesday, Thursday at 11.30 a.m. my time. If you want, you can follow me on my Instagram or my dog's Instagram if you want to keep in touch. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!